Hello everyone, I am back with another haul. This is my Dollar Tree haul, as I mentioned before, in my Walmart haul. Um, I mentioned that I was going to be hopefully going to the Dollar Tree, and I did. Um, I didn't get too much, but I did get some stuff. Um, but before I show the Dollar Tree stuff, um, <coughs> sorry, I went to Walmart again because I had forgotten my medicine when I went there earlier today. Um, I had to get my inhaler, and I totally forgot it. So while I was there, I got a few other things. Um, not much, but I got a few things that I thought I would share. Um, the first thing I got was just a cat Halloween shirt, but I don't have it because my sister, I bought it for my sister and she has it out there with her. But anyhow, um, the first thing I'll show is just another one of these tea things. I just love getting these. these this one is a um, raspberry lemonade. It's not sugar free. Um, it has 28 grams of sugar in it. But um, I asked my sister to go get me the tea in. That's what she brought me. So... I didn't feel like getting in line and waiting and, or I mean, I didn't feel like going back and waiting. I just wanted to get home because I'm still a little sick and not feeling all the best yet. But, so that was that. And then, um, when I went earlier, I had forgotten to get another binder. Um, I just got a, another one inch teal binder, um, for some of the loose pocket letters that I have laying around, um that I've recently gotten. I don't have room in my big one, so I got just this little one for now for the rest of my pots of litters. That is my sister. So I got that. And then I got two movies to watch with my sister. Um, the first one is a movie called Under Wraps. And I saw these movies earlier today and I was looking at them when I, was, when I got the other Halloween movie to watch with her. But I wasn't sure if she would like these movies or not, but since I had her with me this time, I asked her which movie she would like best out of these two, and she goes, well, I'd like to see both of them. So they were only $5, so I bought both of them to watch with her. Um, we got Dear Dracula and Under Wraps, and they just look like super cute movies. Um, this is what this one's about, if you're interested. And then this is what this one's about. So I got those two movies to watch with her this weekend. So yeah, that is um, what I got at Walmart. Now I will jump into my Dollar Tree haul. Um, I have a lot of food items and then I have non-food items. Um, I'm just going to start with the food items first. Um, first, I just got some of these cheese Ritz bits. I love these things. These are one of my favorite snacks. So I got me a little um, bag, big bag, whatever. It says big bag, but whatever. I got a bag of those for me. For when me and my sister watch movies, we're going to switch movies tonight because she doesn't have school tomorrow. Um, then she picked out these for her snack, Reese's. Um, I like Reese's a lot, but I try to stay away from chocolate because it usually makes me sick. But that is what she wanted for her snack, so she got that. And then she also picked out this little thing of Nutter Butters. <clears throat> so that was her snacks. Um, and then I got these maple cream cookies to try... To sh um, for me and my sister to try when we watch our movies. Um, they kind of sounded good, maple cream. I don't know, I've never had them before, but they they sounded good, so I thought, why not? So I got those, and then I got me these candy cookies, the Butterfinger ones. I have had these before, and they are really good. Um, they had another, this um, Bud's Best Cookies brand. Um, they had another brand there that I had really liked, but now I can't remember what it was. I don't remember what it was called, but they don't have it no more, unfortunately. But I want to say it was like a birthday cake cookie. I can't remember, but it was good. And this one's good, too. So if you like Butterfingers and cookies, I recommend these. So I got a box of those. Um, then I got, um, I might have mentioned before that I love apple cider. And they had a little box. You get four pouches. So four for a dollar, I thought was pretty good. So I got just a box of this because I love... Um, the hot apple cider and then I got <clears throat> this um, liquid creamer and it's pumpkin spice um, I have I don't really drink coffee but I have this coffee mix stuff that I like to mix with hot milk so I thought I would get this to try and see how it tastes in there I don't know we used to drink coffee but we don't really know more but I wanted to get that for that just to see how it tastes <clears throat> so I got that. Um, the next thing I got was just a box of the Loretta Deluxe Mac and Cheese Dinners. Um, I have been getting these 
for years at the Dollar Tree, um, for as long as I can remember. And oddly enough, I don't really care much for box macaroni and cheese. I craft, it doesn't taste good to me. But oddly enough, this stuff does taste good to me, and it's like an off-brand from the Dollar Tree. I think this is one of the better macaronis, in my opinion, over Kraft and Velveeta. I just don't care for them, but for some reason I really like this brand. So I got um, just the deluxe mac and cheese dinner one, and then I got um, the shells one. So I got those. Um, the next thing I got was some white cheddar premium popcorn, and I have gotten this before, and it's good. So I got that for our movie snacks, and then I got the um, cheddar cheese one. I can't remember if I've had this one or not, but we shall see how it tastes. So I got that one. <clears throat> um, the next thing I got was just one of these little Donald Duck um, original no pulp orange juice. Just because I'm sick and I just feel like I need some orange juice and vitamin C. I don't know. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I just got, I just, sometimes when I'm sick, I just, I feel like I need orange juice, so I got me a little thing. Sorry, that is my medicine alarm going off. Um, and then the next thing I got was, I've never seen or tried these before, but it looked good. It is a Hershey's Cookies and Cream Flavored Milkshake. So I got that to try. Um, and then my little sister just picked out a Coke for herself. I don't drink pop, um, especially Coke. So I got that. Okay, now moving on to the non-food items. Um, I did get other food items, but they are already put away in the freezer, so I'm not going to bother showing those. Um, but I will move on now to the non-food items. So the first thing I got was this cup, this mug, and it says beautiful, fabulous, glamorous, fabulous, beautiful, glamorous. And I thought this was so cute. I got it to drink the um, hot apple cider out of and like my coffee. Um, chip in there but I'm not too worried about it so I got that <clears throat> um, the next thing that I got was I got my um, I have guinea pigs and I have a, a little cage that has um, my younger guinea pigs in them they're not a year old yet but they're still really little they're not full grown yet so I got them just this littler bowl because they have a the same bowl in there but it's the bigger one from the Dollar Tree and they seem to if I leave the big bowl in there they seem to soil the food because I think it's too much for them to be in the bowl so I thought I would try the little bowl and see if maybe the food doesn't if they don't soil the food in a little bowl so I got that and then the next thing I got was some more smelly good stuff I tell you I can't control myself lately um, I got this Sure Sense Pumpkin Air Freshener Crystal Beads. Um, I've never gotten one of these before. I've never tried them. I don't know how well it's going to work or anything like that. But I figured I would try it. So I got that. And then um, I got the Sure Sense um, Oil thing. I've never tried the oil before neither. But I got this and the thing that it goes in. So I got that to try. Yes, I am just going crazy over the smelly good stuff. Um, when I grabbed this, my mom said she was going to have to put a stop to me soon here. And then I did get another candle. Um, this one smelled really good. It's in the little mason jars, and it has the um, little, like, measuring... My mind is blinking. The little measurements on the side here, and it says um, mason on it. And this is the blueberry pie scent. Mm, it smells so good. It smells just like blueberries and I love blueberries. So I got this one because I did not have this one. And I believe that is all the smelly good. Oh no, it's not all the smelly good stuff. Oh goodness. Okay. Um, then I saw that they had a whole in cap now of incense out. Gon I'm probably going to say this wrong. Gonish? Gon I don't know. Um, but this was a strawberry <coughs> incense sticks. I've never tried incense before neither, so I thought I would try these, maybe burn some incense in the bathroom, I don't know, but I got those to try, and then they had the, um, the incense stick holders there, so I got that. They had a whole bunch of different incense flavors, but I figured I would just, um, stick with the strawberry for now, because I've never really, um, tried incense before, 
and it smells good. I can kind of smell it through the package, so I, <coughs> I got that to try. <coughs> Sorry. Then the next thing I got was just another one of these um, Click and Flame. I use these to light my candles. The one that I have, I got from the Dog Tree um, maybe a year or so ago, and it's starting to run low, so I got another one for when that one goes completely out. So I got that. Um, the next thing I have is I found this book. Yes, I know. I also buy so many books from the Dollar Tree that I never read. I have yet to read one book that I've ever bought from the Dollar Tree. I don't know why I keep buying them, but I do because I know someday I will read them when I get into a reading mood. But um, this one I found, it was a New York bestseller. Um, it's called A Simple Christmas, 12 Stories That Celebrate the True Holiday Spirit. And it looks like this. And I just thought it was, sounded interesting, and I love Christmas, so I figured I would get it, and maybe I would read it at Christmas time. So I got this one. It retails for $22.95 here in the U.S. and in Canada, $28.50. So finding it in Dollar Tree is a good steal, so I got that. Okay, the next and last things I have are makeup products. Um, the first thing I got was the Milani Power Lip gloss stain the strawberry sugar I already hauled this last time for myself this one is for my mom she wanted to try it and in my personal opinion I don't like it I don't like these at all um, when I put them on they just feel sticky or something to me and they don't smear that great to me I didn't like them but my mom wanted her own and she wanted to try it for herself so got her that I don't care for them um, the next thing I got was this LA Colors loose eyeshadow in the color snow white it's in this little thing like this um i thought i would try one of these i've never tried it before but i thought i'd give this kind of makeup a try so i got that then i got this auto eyeliner and it's in black by la colors so i think you just turn it and it comes up so i got that <clears throat> And then I got another one of these. I have a, quite a few of them. This is a duo eyeliner crayon. This is, um, it includes a sharpener. And this is the smoky color. One side is eyeliner and one side is eyeshadow. Um, I, this is the current, currently I am using this. I don't know if it's this color, but it's this same exact duo eyeliner. I use it on my bottom eye. Um, it works okay it works pretty good but it does smear um, on your bottom it doesn't stick really well but um, it was just really easy for me to use so this is what I usually use for my bottom eye and so I just got another one so yeah I got that um, then the next thing that I got was um, these wet and wild fake eyelashes and it comes with the glue I don't know how to do fake eyelashes. I've never tried. Um, so I can't say that I don't know how, but I've never done it before. I've never tried. So I thought that I would try. So I got these to try and see if I could do it. So I got that. I've been watching tutorial videos here on YouTube for that, just like I did with my top eyeliner. And I finally, I'm not perfect yet, but I am starting to get how you do it on the top. So now maybe I can hopefully try the fake eyelashes. So we will see. And then the last thing for this haul that I got was another one of the Profusion palettes. This one is um, a blue glittery one with a bow. I, th I think these are so cute. Um, I hauled one. Um, yeah, I can't find it. But I hauled one in my last Dollar Tree haul. One for me and my mom. And I really like it. It's currently the eyeshadow that I have on right now is the Profusion, my other palette. <clears throat> trying to open it here but I really liked the colors in this one because they were really glittery if you can see can you see all that glitter and I love glitter glittery makeup I love it so I got me that so yes that was everything for this Dollar Tree haul I hope that you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a beautiful day night so yeah, thanks for watching. Bye guys.